Oh yeah, baby boy, you did real good, real good. Let me let me spit shine you up real good. Oh hey guys, welcome back to New Stuff TV, the untechnical tech channel, and your home for the best infotainment on YouTube, baby. I'm your host Antoine. My pool ain't gonna never be green, Richardson, because today we are talking about some pool tech, man. We always talk about like robot vacuums and all kinds of home tech and stuff like that, but we've never talked about outdoor pool tech. And that's where Aper comes in. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Is it Aper? Maybe it is, maybe it's not, who knows? But this is the Seagull Pro and I'm polishing it up because my baby boy just got done working outside at my pool. But let's tell you more about him. One of Aper's goals is to create a smart yard ecosystem. This is something I've never really thought of before, but it's a thing now. As you can see here, the only real components I have on the table is the unit itself. That's because it's cordless and hoseless. So for all you people who are using pool cleaners right now, you don't have to worry about hooking up the little vacuum hose or plugging it in, risking shock and stuff like that. This is all you need. Now it's got a quad motor system. It's the world's first implementation of a dual draining motor and a dual suction motor being applied to a robotic pool cleaner. It pumps up to 130 gallons per minute and it's the most powerful cordless robotic cleaner on the market right now. It uses a wave path navigation technology to ensure complete coverage on your pool's floors, walls, and water line. Yes, I said walls and the water line. Now let's talk just a little bit about the motors. If you look at the top of the unit here, you'll see underneath those two grills are two fans. That's what's gonna shoot out that 130 gallons per minute and that's gonna keep it glued to the floor or the wall as the unit is running either horizontally or vertical up and down your walls. Now I did mention it was cordless and hoseless. And that means it's got a built-in battery that's gonna last up to three hours for cleaning and it only takes about 90 minutes to charge it all the way back up from empty. And I can tell you right now, they actually gave this thing a lot of thought when it came to the design because it has a water quick release system. That way when you pull it out of the water, it just drains super fast. And that way you can just park it, store it, or charge it up if you need to really quick. You don't have to sit there draining water out of it. So if you're actually considering getting one of these things, I guess your next question would be is, what size pool should I actually have? Well, my pool is very small. It's actually considered a cocktail pool at about 1,500 square feet. But this is actually rated up to 3,200 square feet as far as the pool size is concerned. But I like it because it's a compact unit and in a pool of my size, and it's a freeform pool, it actually does a very, very good job cleaning it because of its compact size and efficiency. So as I continue to wipe my baby boy down real quick because he did work so hard for for me, I do want to tell you a little bit about my personal experience in my small pool. And of course, I'm going to show it demonstrated in a larger, more standard size pool as well, but I'm going to talk about my personal experience. The first thing I wanted to mention was the, uh, the charging port. It's right here on the side if I turn it here. But wait, before I even get to that, let's talk about how cool this thing looks. It looks like a little car, like a little space age buggy, right? You got your, your hood or your front end right here. Then you got a, it's not a spoiler on it, dude. Look at this carbon fiber spoiler. Anyways, let's go over here to the right hand side. It's like the gas tank right here. So you just unplug this and boom, there you go. Now it is waterproof but it's not completely waterproof until you seal this back up. So before you uh, decide to dunk it in water again, make sure you have this thing plugged up and then it's gonna be waterproof again. You don't wanna damage any electronics into that little port. Now, as I lift it up so you can see the front, you'll see these brushes right here. These are the brushes that actually scrub a dub dub your pool. And they're, they're separated. It's not one brush, it's actually separated into two. You got one on the left and one on the right, and they go along with the wheels and motors. So as the wheels spin, that's what makes the brushes spin as well. Now on the back side, all you gotta do is grip your fingers around that spoiler right there. I'm smiling because I said spoiler. Seriously, man, it's got a carbon fiber spoiler. This is so awesome. That's where you lift up the trunk and then you pull out the waste bin right here. Now mine is soaking wet because I did actually use it and it works very well. I was very surprised. My pool looked clean like from my eyes, but down there, <laughs> my little robot Seagull Pro was actually doing the work. It had a bunch of dirt and grime trapped in this thing and I had to hose it out with the water hose. But this thing is easy to clean. Of course, you can see all the sides have, you know, this mesh here where it collects all the stuff and it doesn't come back out once it's trapped in there. And then you just wash it out and you just dump it back in and you are good to go. Another thing I really like about it is simple operation. It's just got your turn dial right here. Right now it's off. Once you turn it on, you can go to auto, which is gonna clean your walls and your floor. And then that's gonna be your floor and this is gonna be walls only. Or you can just turn it all the way off when you're done and then it's gonna shut down. 
I also wanted to show you how big the included charging brick is. This is it. That's a lot of power shooting through this thing. So it's about as big as my hand and then some. But you just plug it in with that DC power, get this thing charged up within 90 minutes. There's also an included retrieval hook. This way you can just attach it to your existing pole that you should have if you have a pool and you can just fish it right out of the water once you're done cleaning. Now I've had my pool for about two years now and I've been cleaning it myself this entire time. And I actually thought I was doing a great job. You know, I'll scrub the walls from the floor from time to time. I'll do all the fluids and stuff like that, the chemicals. But it wasn't until I got this, the Seagull Pro, that I realized my pool was still dirty. You should have seen all that grit and grime that came out of there. So this thing is actually doing a better job of cleaning my pool than I do. And it's a lot easier on my pool filters because that stuff isn't being, you know, tossed into the, into the main filters anymore. So that's great. I think this would be a great purchase for anybody. I actually have a cocktail pool. It's a lot smaller and it's already saved me a bunch of time with my pool cleaning and I love the convenience of it. So someone with a larger pool up to 3,200 gallons or 3,200 square feet, this thing is a game changer and a no brainer. I'm not an expert in this kind of stuff, but what I do know is my water ain't green and my pool ain't nasty and gritty on the bottom or the walls anymore. <laughs> Y'all keep being good to each other and I'll see you when I see you.